Uh, Mike, happy birthday. Um, hey, Mike, I had a question for you. Why were you so warm on your birthday? Because everybody kept toasting you. Uh, Mike, I can't wait to sing you this song that I wrote about a tortilla. Well, it, it's really more of a rap. Mike, I've been reading this book about anti-gravity. I can't put it down. This is weird. I had completely forgotten how to throw a boomerang. And then it just came back to me. You know, it's really hard to explain puns to kleptomaniacs because they take things literally. What did one birthday candle say to the other one? What? Birthdays just burn me up. <laughs> <laughs> that a lot of the, like, heat birthday humor. What do you call a midget fortune teller who kills their clients? Um. A small medium at large. Hey, Mike, how does Moby Dick celebrate his birthday? How? It's a whale of a party. What do nosy peppers do? What? Get jalapeno business. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think the best part of living in Switzerland is? I don't know, but the flag is a big plus. Hey, Joe. What? Why can't the bike stand on its own? Because it's too tired. I mean, I'm sh I sure I'm glad I know sign language. It's really handy. Really handy. Mike, I don't know if you know this. I recently started a band. Yeah. Uh, we're called 999 Megabytes. We haven't got a gig yet. <laughs> <laughs> and you never will. Oh, I know. You want to hear a, a pizza joke? You bet. It's pretty cheesy. Never mind. No. Oh, man. It's a terrible story to report. Oh? Well, these police were called out to a daycare center, and they had to arrest a three-year-old. Uh, he was resisting arrest. That was stupid. I don't get it. He didn't want to take a rest. You know, Joe recently got crushed by a big pile of books, but um, really he only has a shelf to blame. Yeah. I think that if towels could tell jokes, they'd have a really dry sense of humor. Really true. Hey, Joe. What? Have you heard about the corduroy pillows? Nope. They're making headlines everywhere. How'd the hipster burn his tongue? He no. drank his coffee before it was cool. Mike, if you leave alphabet soup out on the stove, it could spell disaster. Don't do it. Oh, my God. Look at this. Look at this. Cartoonist found dead in his home. The details are sketchy. Knock, knock. Who's there? Europe? You're a poo. No, you're a poo. What does one bean say to another? Well, How do you mean? How do you get a nun pregnant? I have an idea, but I'm not going to answer. You have sex with her. I'll tell you this much. When Peter Pan punches, they never land. Because they never land. Got it. Never land. You have to make it never land. No one knew she had a dental implant until it came out in conversation. They uh, never okay. land. They never land. They never land. Because the joke is never land. Do not trust atoms. Well, they make up everything. They never, the punches never land. Yeah, but the joke there is that it's in Neverland. I get what the joke is, but you okay. gotta you gotta make it clear that they never they, yeah, they, and P they and never land. You also didn't say throws a punch. What do you call a fish with no eyes? A fish. When Peter Pan punches. Throws a punch. When Peter Pan throws a punch. Never lands. They never land. It never lands. That see yeah. that's like that that's that ruins a joke. I think you ruined the joke. <laughs> Have you ever smelled mothballs? Yes. How did you get their little legs far enough apart? I'm not saying that she's a slut. I'm just saying she got fired from the sperm bank for drinking on the job. <laughs>